This is not a kid-friendly show. <laughs> Yo, what is really good, my dudes? Welcome to another RuneScape News coverage video. So we're going to cover over a tweet by Mod Shawnee. So without any further ado, let's just jump right into it. He says, I love tap days. Today I look at the hit splats when you use an ability, and this is what I've done so far. Thoughts. Then he shows these two images here, where you see him fighting a training dummy in Lumbridge. However, we now have these new options that let you change the color of your hit splats based on the combat style you are using. So I'm sure you'll have a selection of different colors. Maybe you get to choose to have them all the same color if you want it that way to have the current look. But you get to color coordinate your hit splats with this update. Not only that, you'll be able to color coordinate other players' hit splats. So you can differentiate just based on color exactly who hit what whether it be you or whoever you're with. Also, important to note, you can completely hide other players' hit splats entirely if you just want to purely see your own, which I know a lot of people wanted, so I'm sure many of you are going to be happy to hear that. Me, personally, I think I still want to see other people's hit splats, but I do want to see those color coordinated to differentiate whether I hit a certain hit or whether my friends happen to hit that hit. So I'm really excited to see that. Next up, he actually does have another tweet where he says, here you can see that I have dark blue selected for my mage abilities and yellow for other players melee abilities and this is what it looks like just to give you a, a visual of what it'll actually feel and look like when you're actually utilizing it in game so here it is it shows his magic hit splat and the melee hit splat so that's how it'll visually represent itself in game you'll see that dead as night difference and I'm really excited. This is Mod Shawnee working on it, so I have confidence he's going to do a good job. He's the same one that did the ability buff bar when he split the buff and debuff bars. He did a really good job there, and he's really always adding new things to it also. So I think Shawnee's going to do a good job. He also did the filter overlay update, which is really awesome. So I'm pretty sure he's going to do a good job. Anyways, I will report on it as soon as we get more news about when it's going to come out live to the game. So just sit tight for that on the channel. Anyways, if you like the video, hit that like button if you are not subscribed yet and you want to stay up to date on all things runescape related then hit that subscribe button i promise to keep you up to date on all things runescape anyways i appreciate you watching i am out peace oh, dear,